your name. Jesus, you deserve the praise. What is your name? <laughs>
nobody like you, Jesus. There's nobody like you, Jesus. Honor to your name. You deserve the praise. Honor to your name. Honor to your name.
So as you are standing right now, you are standing right before the Lord, before the Lord, before the Lord. This is Zion, the city of the living God, for we have not come to a man that can be taught. We have come to the city of God. We have come to innumerable company of angels. We have come to the heavenly Jerusalem. That's where you are. This place is now Zion. This place ceases to be a building. Is now Zion. And two things happen in Zion. Upon Mount Zion, there shall be deliverance. There shall be holiness. And the people shall possess their possession. This is where you have come. You have come to Jesus, the mediator of the new covenant. You have come to the blood of sprinkling that speaks better things than the blood of heaven. You have come. You have come to the spirit of just men, men prophet, ladies and gentlemen. That's where you are right now. You are standing face to face with the Father. So your worship is different. Your approach is different. You are standing in front of the Lord right now. And I'm asking you, what will you say when you see him? What will you say to him when you see him? For when we see him, we shall be like him. If you see him, you shall be like him. Beloved, we with an unveiled face, we with an unveiled face, beholding the glory as in a mirror, we are being changed into the same image from glory to glory. When you see him, what will you tell him? When I see my lover, I will tell him, Lord, you are worthy. Lord, you are worthy. Nobody like you. Lord, you are worthy. I bless you. And when I'm short of words, I go in tongues. When I'm short of words, I go in tongues. When I'm short of what to say, I go around the pelo. Ustelia Catholic, Eleto Pianato, Esuferiane, Rico Perro Nesteliano, Eco Beco Pelegabella, Esopelia Combenanata. This is how I bless the Lord. This is how I bless the Lord. When I have no words to say, I just turn to tongues. It doesn't mean Eco Pe, Mirana Satel, Alaso Periano. Worship is more than a song. It's father to child, spirit to spirit. I said it's father to child, it's spirit to spirit. I don't need a song. I brought him more than a song. What I brought is more than a song. A conte rebelli, ustali anataya, and opere ne coperada, and soperada taya. This is how I bless the Lord. This is how I bless the Lord. This is how I bless the Lord. Let the river flow. Let the river of worship break forth. Let the river of worship break forth. Let the river of worship break forth. You don't need a song. A song can help you. But essentially, worship is not a song. Worship is not a song. For God is spirit. And those who must worship must worship in spirit and in truth so when i sing in the holy ghost that's why paul said i will sing in tongues and then when my my mind gets understanding i will sing in understanding so worship does not start from your mouth it starts from your spirit to your soul until your voice can be echo what your hey. And the angels cry, oh, holy, all creation cries, holy, you are lifted high, holy, holy forever. We are being Bingo. 
this room. Lift your hands and declare your name. Your name is the highest. Your name hey. is the greatest. Your name stands above the All thoughts and dominion. All power. Hey. Your name yes, God. Yes, God.
hand over to Pastor James. We're going to read out loud. Listen, one of the things you must realize is kings don't suggest. Kings and queens, they decree. Kings don't apologize. They decree. You must learn how to put God's tone in your voice and come into the place of authority. Now you have offered sacrifice as a priest. Now you are about to decree as a king. Come on. We're going to read together. We are not reading like just reading, reading literature. We are about to decree. Things are about to shift now. <laughs> where the word of the king is there is power I said where the word of the king is there is power don't doubt the power that is about to be released Psalm 133 says how good and pleasant it is for brethren to dwell together in unity he said it's like the oil that flows from heaven's earth to his birth and to his skirt and then the verse 3 says yeah, he has commanded his blessing. There's a commanded blessing when we gather together like this. One shall chase a thousand, two shall chase ten thousand. Exponentially, hundred people shall chase. Oh, come on. So you are about to decree the words you say now carry the same power. Is as if Jesus is speaking. <laughs> oh, you didn't get that. You didn't get that. You didn't get that. I said the words you are about to say now. No wonder Jesus said in Luke 22, said, He who hears you, hears me. He says, what I can do, you can now do. Your voice is not my voice. Your voice is now my voice. What you say, I must honor. <laughs> Lord have mercy. I pray that the eyes of your understanding be enlightened, that you may see, you may know. You may know these are the riches of his glory. In, in these are the riches of his glory that Paul was saying in Ephesians 1, 17, 18, 19, 20. That the eyes of your understanding, that the veil may be removed. Amen. That you may know, you must know, that your words carry power. You must know that when you speak, angels move. Yes. When you come in oneness with Christ, when you come in oneness with Christ, you and Jesus are the same. And I say that in, in, in respect, in respect to the new creation reality, not in Keda. I'm not talking about the Keda of Jesus as the Lord. I'm talking about the sonship that we now have in Jesus. So when you speak, you speak as though, my God, Psalm 82, the Bible says, ye are God and the children of the Most High. But in case you don't understand this principle, you will die like men. Ye are God. It means that your words now carry power. You, you sound like a God. What a heritage. What an inheritance we have in Christ. So the words you are about to speak now, because I know some of us have declared the scripture many times, and it looks powerless. It only looks powerless to you. Demons know this voice. Bless the Lord, you his angels. Who are came to the world? Angels move at your command. Your words are not empty. They are not echo. They rumble. They cause an uproar in the realm of the spirit. So we are about to decree. I said all I said to bring you to a point of boldness and confidence. That the words you are about to say are not, are not suggestions. These are decrees. Amen. So clear your throat. <laughs> Put a God stone on your voice. And decree like kings. Can we go? Everybody. The earth, the earth is, is the, the Lord. Lord and, and all his fullness. fullness. The, the world and those who dwell there. Therein. For he, he has founded it upon the seas. seas and established it upon the waters. Who may ascend into the hill of the Lord. Lord. A woman stand in his holy place. He who has clean hands and a pure heart, who has not lifted up his soul to an idol, 
nor sworn deceitfully. He shall receive blessings from the Lord and righteousness from the God of his salvation. This is Jacob, the generation of those who seek him, who seek your face. Lift up your heads, O you gates, and be lifted up you everlasting doors. And the King of glory shall come in. Who is this King of glory? The Lord strong and mighty. The Lord mighty in battle. Lift up your hearts, all you gates. Lift up you everlasting doors. And the King of glory shall come. Who is this King of glory? The Lord of us. He is. Somebody blast into town. See you later.
Samuel 5, it says, When the Philistines took the ark of God, they brought it into the house of Dagon, their God, and set the ark there. And when the people of Ashdod rose early in the morning, there was Dagon falling on his face to the earth. Did you hear me? They brought the ark of God into the place where they had another God. But when they brought the king in, every other God had to fall. I believe tonight some other gods are falling as you leave the name of Jesus heart and you welcome the king of glory in. Depression, it's falling. Idolatry, it's falling. Barrenness, it's falling. Confusion, it's falling. Witchcraft, it's falling. Deception, it's falling. Immorality, falling. Loss, falling. Addiction, falling. King of glory, King of glory, King of glory, King of glory. It's not to let him part us. Aye, aye, pinoses. Itila sonamaya. Etataya, 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 etataya. Akata, kata, kata. King of glory. King of glory, have your glory. E batuli si kandasas, i kata lete pote, i vaya nuntas. A bay 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 bay. E tu 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 la, a kata talaya. E vailo na mandases, aye aye tu tanases. I va 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 nuntu taya.
is from the Lord. It shall be called Jesus. For this holy thing that you carry, there is a holy thing to be born. There is a holy thing that you carry. Can we tarry? Can we travel for the next generation? Can we travel? Can we scatter? Can we clear the highway? For the ever, every valley shall be exalted. Every mountain shall be brought low. Every good, every good place shall be made most. Every rough place shall be ah, and the glory is about to be revealed over a generation. Somebody push a little more, 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 a little more. A da 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 da. Extend the quadrant. Mirado, Salani, Falada, Esene, Ekani, Epaya, Mazala, Epaya, Passa, Pacua, Passa, Somebody push! Yes, I'll be better than that guy, too. Mento, Bela, Talada, Tua, Telade. O, Selebe, Rabi, Atalea, Sofaka. Matala, Nabayana. Asale. If I see 50 people, will I destroy the city? If I see 40, will I destroy? If I see 30, will you destroy? If you see 20, will you destroy? If you see 10, will you destroy? Ladies and gentlemen, say it, we are more than 10. We are more than 20. We are more than 50 righteous people here. We even stand in the righteousness of God, in Christ Jesus. Therefore, we declare over our children, we pull down every imagination, we scatter Every imagination, it has no foundation. Then we pull them down now.
Lord, we declare tonight, Lord, that you are the risen King. We declare tonight that you are the risen King. You are the risen King, Lord. You are the King of glory. Come on, guys, let's keep singing this a minute. Let's keep singing this to the Lord right now. Just close your eyes, focus on the Lord right now. You at home as well, start to sing this with a full heart to the Lord right now. Yes, Lord.
Silaba, Rama Mama Boboko Santa Catalia, Rama Boko Sile Catilia, Rama Mamo Cotalia, Macatilla Casota Catilia, Maco Cai Lava, Lacazala Catele Catila Babo, Hallelujah! De Catia Bo, Macasi Catila Babo Mamo Mamo Mamo, E Catilia, O Catolia Babo. Sakatila bakasila babo kosekatila kare babo raba kosakatila babo kosakatila kazala kazalia babo kazele bakatila be Let's start to keep praying in the spirit right now friends and start to ask the Lord right now that he would take control of every area of your heart Thank you Lord that we will not share your glory with another we will not share our heart with an idol we will share our heart with the King of Glory. So start to declare that tonight, that your heart is God's. Your heart is God's. Hila baba kataya babo. Let's keep praying in the spirit, friends. Hila baba kosala katila baba. This is a spiritual matter right now. Hila ba kosali ama. Rababo kotila bakase katila. Makotile bebe katila babo. Rabako si katile be katilia. Vlako sa katile yamo. La mama mo sonda katila kitilia. Ho rababo kosi kataye. Rabako sala kazila. Let's stay in this same vein, declaring him the Lord, declaring him the King. Keep your eyes fixed on him right now. Begin to offer everything, everything, crowning him with many crowns. Crowning him with many crowns. He is the risen King. You are the risen King, Jesus. Jesus.
shining as the sun. And the trumpets go. Why is 
black seas shall be regained. There shall not be rivers in the desert. Say the spirit of grace. Allah Sopheria de Kupalana, a people who serve in darkness, unto you has appeared a great light. I speak as I hear. Does the light of God shine up? My God is starting like a candle. I see a candle. The bomb. This bomb becomes an allergy lamp, and I can see the floodlight of heaven over this nation. A little here, a little there, a little here, a little here, and this path of the just shall begin to shine, shall begin to shine ever brighter and brighter. United Kingdom, your head shall not be buried in shame again. There is restitution, there is reconciliation, and there is restoration. Say the spirit of grace. sons and daughters. Your sons shall yet carry this fire. See the spirit of grace. Expect it to start any time from now. The move of the spirit. Shall you not know it when you see it? Shall you not recognize it when you see it? The Lord is about to move again. And this glory shall be revealed. And all flesh shall see it together. The mountains shall be brought low. The valleys shall be exalted. The rough places shall be made straight. Oh, the crooked places shall be made smooth. This glory is about to shine again. In the name of the Lord Jesus, I see light. I see light over this nation again. The light of God is shining again over this nation. Mark the words of the Spirit Mark the words of God. These are not my words. These are the words of Elohim. I speak as I'm commanded. I see light shine again. I see light shine again. Isaiah 9 verse 2. A people who sat in darkness. Unto them has appeared a great light. I see light shine again. I see this purpose of revival begin, begin to move everywhere. I see this. I see 300 foxes. I see their tails being lit and I see them running into the camp of the Philistines, destroying every investment of hell. I see it, I see it, I see it, I see it, I see it again. The things that were seen many years ago, the moves and the investment of Evans Robert, the West Revival, the revival that started in Scotland, the Lord says, I'm about to kindle that light again. It's about to, oh Lord, have mercy. This light is about to shine again. Rejoice, O oh daughters of Zion, for your Redeemer comes. Rejoice, O oh daughters of Zion, for your Redeemer comes. Things are going to change from now on. Now on, from this moment, see the spirit of grace. I can say here, Happy New Year is a new season. Yes, Anana Mande is not all that I have. Hi, Anana. Just lift your hands. We're going to make this declaration in agreement with that word over this land. Father, we're declaring back to you yes and amen to your words over this land. You have not forgotten the United Kingdom. The seeds of revival that have been sown in years past, the labors of those who have gone ahead of us. Father, right now, our prayers, our declarations, our sacrifices of, of intercession and fasting, we're joining in with the prayers that have gone ahead of us. And we're saying, Lord, this is the day of the outpouring of your spirit upon all flesh. Our sons and our daughters will prophesy. 
from Scotland to Wales to Ireland to England, all across the British Isles, we say it's a new day of revival. It's a new day of awakening. Out of the mouths of babes and suckling, you have ordained strength. Therefore, our children are going to arise and carry this revival fire. The adults are going to arise and carry this revival fire from one generation to the next. For our sons and daughters will prophesy, our old men will dream dreams, and our young men will see visions. So these are the days of the spirit of Elijah resting upon a generation, turning the hearts of the sons to the fathers, and the fathers to the sons. Father, this is the day you spoke about. We agree with the move of heaven. We say, let it be, let it be, let it be. Like a mighty rushing river, like a mighty rushing river, unstoppable. It doesn't matter what the enemy does, he will not stop this move. He cannot stop this move. An army is arising, a new breed of warriors arising across the British Isles. A sound is being released, an alarm is being sounded in the spirit right now. Oh, the bones are beginning to rattle. The bones are beginning to rattle. We sound the alarm in the spirit. Oh, let the bones begin to rattle. An army, an army is arising. An army is arising. And therefore we sound the alarm. We say, let the army of the end time revival arise, 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 arise. lift your voice and we're going to lift our voice as a sounding of a new season some of you came here dealing with all sorts of things some of you watching online are going through all sorts we're going to lift our voice to release a signal a sound in the spirit that this is the beginning of a new season in the spirit we're stepping into what the Lord is speaking right now our sons, our daughters, families being restored. Depression, oppression, lifting, leaving people. People coming into a season of light where your light has come. You rise and you shine for your light has come. So we're going to lift our voice as the sound of that new season. Are you ready? I said, are you ready? Yes. Lift your voice.
Jesus, we honor you. We crown you with many crowns. We thank you for a new day dawning. We thank you for freedom. We thank you for channels of our spirits so opening up and opened up tonight. We thank you for releases from heaven. We thank you for our mind decoding the mysteries that have been released from heaven. We thank you for dreams and visions. How we thank you for clarity. We thank you that we would hear a voice behind us saying this is the way we should go and would walk therein. You're our master. You're not just our savior. You're our master. You're our king. Therefore, we come under your government, Lord. We love you, Jesus.